can you tell us a little bit about what the shop is, what it's got and what it has to offer? Uh, it's all second-hand and vintage, or mostly second-hand and vintage, originating in the US and Canada. Uh, Canada's where the, where the company's based. Mm -hmm. uh, originally, in, in the 80s, the owner of Rocket, he realised he could make money on Camden Market by selling second-hand clothes from the States. Okay. Uh, so he started off there in the 80s, got a shop on the high street, mm -hmm. and uh, since branched out, there's one here on Brick Lane, mm -hmm. uh, Camden, and the flagship store in Covent Garden now. Okay. And like I say, it's all second-hand and, and vintage stuff. What about Rocket itself? Do you produce any clothes yourself? There's some customised items, okay. which are, there's some second-hand jeans just over there that we've taken in to, to create the skinny jeans, mm -hmm. and for the summer we cut jeans off to make shorts as well. Okay. Uh, we print up our own t-shirts, uh, denim skirts made out of old jeans, mm -hmm. and uh, there's some jewellery and other accessories that we buy in mm -hmm. as well, new from, from the wholesaler. And what about price range? It's cheaper than perhaps, uh, uh, it's cheaper than designer wear, or, mm -hmm. you know, but um, mm -hmm. it's, it's more expensive than, than a charity shop because sure. this, is, this is the good stuff. We've gone through all the second-hand clothes and picked out mm -hmm. the good stuff, so... Mm -hmm. uh, so yeah, it's slightly more expensive than, than people might expect second-hand clothes to be, but that's the reason for it. Sure, sure. Um, but it's still affordable. Is it just women's clothes, or do you also do men's clothes? No, women's and men's. Um, we have uh, this store is the the largest brick lane store, and we've got a, a lot of men's wear in here. Uh -huh. There's also a, a small boutique just a, a couple of doors up, and that's okay. that's just women's wear in there. And in there as well, there's a lot of particularly nice sort of twenties, thirties dresses, things like that. Okay, Colin, I can see you've got some really funky, cool, and original clothes here. Uh, what kind of people actually shop at Rocket? Uh, all, all kinds of people shop here. We have a lot of uh, fashion students coming here, as well as young designers, mm -hmm. um, musicians, uh, some. Big designers as well come in to, to pick okay. up their, their pieces to, for inspiration. Okay. <laughs> and uh, some high street, uh, high street designers come in for inspiration as well. Really? Uh, okay. So basically you get a broad mix of people mm. from different backgrounds, different ages yeah. as well, I guess? Yeah, yeah, all sorts of ages. The, the young people. A lot of people... Uh, we're, we're in a lot of magazines in, in Sweden and Japan and, right. and we get a lot of tourists come over looking specifically for the rocket shop. They right. come with a, a magazine cutting and right. the, the, they've seen something that they want uh, or the type of thing that they want, so, so they come here especially. There's, there's all kinds of just one-off pieces in here that if, you, if you're just looking for for that special item, something yeah. different from what you might find on the high street, that's, that's here as well.